Okay, so this tutorial is about um, the uh, disappearing effect in our latest video, Pop Goes the Weasel. <laughs> Funny name. Okay, um, so uh, just opened up a new project, made a new project, um, and you're going to want to select your footage. Um, just this looks good right there. Press E. HQ, send me out. Pretty epic. Okay. Um. So you want to blade your footage right before you want your subject to disappear. Um. I'm gonna blade them right here. And then have your when you're shooting the footage, make sure your subject walks off a of frame right after he wants to disappear or he or she wants to disappear so in Final Cut you want to blade right when he's walking off frame so what we'll have here is just him disappearing okay so how did I do the pixelating or um, disappearing and all that stuff okay I um took like a couple frames before he disappeared bladed it so I just have that went into um, effects went down to all just typed in wait, just typed in pixelate and basically I have this area footage that's pixelated so I want to take a little bit before that Put it on top of the pixelated footage, like that, and I'm going to go into effects, keying, mask, invert the mask, select the area where you want this um, the subject or whatever to disappear, so just that area will be pixelated. Um, and I'm going to animate the amount of pixelation. It's going to start out from zero. Press this little plus sign. That, that's the um, keyframe button. Go to the, all the way to the end, like right before the end, and bring it up just about right here. So now, if you watch your footage, this is what you have. You have him sort of pixelating out and, well, as you can tell, it looks pretty boring. So we want to sele select the top layer. Command 6 will um, pop up your color adjustment wheels. And I took, this is what I did. I took my, um, my global, changed it to, oh wait. Remember, have the right sele layer selected. I took the global, changed it to this um, about like a purplish blue color the same just adjusted it a little bit like that just the exposure a little bit okay so now you can see you can clearly see the line so I want to select my masked area and feather it so it blends in Okay, now I am gonna get a lens flare. I just I don't have any optical flares. I bet it's great. I'm I want to get it. Looks really cool. But I'm gonna look look up a picture of lens flares and on Google and and um just take this uh lead it to where you want it. I'm going to have it start a little after, maybe. Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, send, set the blending mode to additive mode. Um, I'm going to rotate it. Just do, this is how I did it. You can do, obviously, whatever you want. This is how I did it, though. 
so now you have a sort of like he's he's like sending Aaron out. So I'm gonna take this, also pixelate it, do the same thing, just all pixelate. So we're gonna have it start out very just to have it be nothing. Start this like a little before. Okay, so I'm going to have the lens first start a little before it actually gets colored, um, like that. And go to a frame after, like that. And we'll have it go from zero, the amount of pixelation, to 100%. So it looks like it's pixelating with Aaron. In this lens flare sort of gives you an effect of like it's like like shooting down a laser and picking him up or something like that. Um but um Okay. So, it looks sort of weird he just disappears. So you want to extend your Extend your um, overlay footage and have it sort of wait, sort of fade out like sort of fade out like um, this. So have it at hundred percent. Keyframe it, and now it's at zero. So let's watch this. It looks pretty good. Um, um, if you have any requests for tutorials or any movie ideas, comment below. Um, send us an email, maybe at ladymoreproductions at gmail dot com. Oh, and I forgot sound effects. Sound effects are very important to sell your effect or whatever you want to do. In this latest video, we added a lot of sound effects. Um, let's see. Um, Final Cut has their own bunch of sound effects. I just took like, let's see, zipper. Let's see that zipper dress, luggage zipper. <laughs> That's sort of cool. It's just like a zipper um, effect, sound effect. I'm going to extend that a little over my teleportation like that. Have it. I'll turn on like um I'll go to effects, it audio effects modulation tremolo. Um, that's pretty cool. Um, I'm going to also going to add some maybe laser Yeah, that's what I used. Maybe turn it down a little bit. Alright, um... Also, you can see there's like a whole like, halo of pixelation around him. That's sort of cool. Alright, um, so let's take these sound effects. You don't always, it's actually sort of cool if you don't always have them lined up because you can have like different parts of different things um, lining up differently and it like sells the effect more. Let's see. Maybe turn the zipper up more. That's pretty good. So that's how you do um, the a disappearing effect. You can do it many, many different ways. This is sort of the outline. This is just the way I did it. But enjoy your Thanksgiving and adios.